today we are here with the My Geek Box. It took a long time to get here because it's from the UK and um, a lot of people have been giving it bad reviews lately because um, their customer service isn't exactly up to other subscription boxes standards. Um, in order to cancel your subscription, you have to email them. There's no like unsubscribe button, you have to email them. And then a lot of people get confused about, you know, when you can cancel it and when you can't cancel it. Um, but just a simple email to them being like, hey, I want to cancel it, how do I do this? They're like, oh, well, if you cancel within 14 days after the dispatch, which is the shipping, uh, then you just, it's canceled. So, you're supposed to get an email. I didn't get an email, but they give you a date. So, like, in between the 20th to the 20-something, that's when you... Um, that's when you unsubscribe. It was as easy as that. You know, I canceled my subscription, they again sent me an email, they were like, okay, you're canceled, and then that was it. When I got this box, the only reason why I got this box is because they were having a deal where it was like 10 pounds or whatever, which is $15 for the US. They were having a $15 box sale, um, and then there was also a free shipping sale, so I only played like a flat rate of like $15 if you want just a regular uh, my geek box it is $26.95 plus around $4 shipping so it's gonna be around $30 for the box um, which is about the same price as any other geek box uh, loot crates like $20 but who anime is still around 30 and a little bit more uh, $30 is what you will usually pay for a subscription box so this does stay within the prices right so I'm just gonna dive right in only reason why I bought this is because of the deal I how much of a nerd I am. What did you see when you open the box? It's a shirt. Oh. Okay. Very interesting. I don't like black shirts, but at the same time I do. Oh, of course I get this now. So I wonder if the theme is gonna... Ugh, something I don't like in there. Alright. So this goes with, you know, the Civil War theme. Captain America. I um, wish I had this because I just went and saw the movie. This would have been a cool thing to wear. You know? It's a broken shield, although the shield shouldn't break. It doesn't break. Alright, well, there's that. It's an interesting shirt. Very interesting. Next we have this looks like ah, Slimer from Ghostbusters. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god, this is really good in there. Okay. So it is slime, the slime thing from the Ghostbusters that throws up all over them. It's really cute actually. I think I'm going to put them up somewhere. Alright, so that's cute. Next we have Blind Box mini series. It looks like DC Comics. You can get anyone on the back. I'm going to open it up right now just to see who I got. Oh no! Green Lantern! Oh my god. There's blush on him. It must be cold where he's at. He has a little punch too. He has abs. He has abs and he has a little punch. I can respect that. Alright, so I got a little green lantern. The next thing I'm going to be doing this is my sister probably. And Doctor Who. It looks like Sonic Screwdriver. I feel like they give these out a lot in these nerd subscription boxes, so I feel like people will just have like collections of the sonic screwdrivers. This goes with- oh, this is- this is unique though. This goes with a third Doctor from 1970 to 1974. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna say that's pretty cool. And this. This is really random, I must say. Um, it is VHS 2. Like what? That's a really random movie, the fact that it's the second movie. But the thing is, it's kind of weird because my fiance and I, we both absolutely love the VHS movies. I don't know why. It's like, they're kind of like little short clips. And like, they summon Satan or something. I don't even know. What are the, this is the one that summons Satan. They summon Satan in this one. I'm sorry if that's a spoiler, but it really isn't. Um, this, this only has like two stars, I think. And it's kind of sad that they would send this, but I just love that I got this movie. This is one of my favorite movies. I am so happy right now. 
I love this. I am so happy right now. That just made this box for me. It's so random. So the next thing that we have in the box is Empire issue one. It is a, I don't know. I like that it's an issue one, not an issue two. Um, I mean, the art seems really pretty. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't know if I'm gonna do my goodbye now or when I show you guys this stuff up close, but thank you all for watching and I hope you guys would like and subscribe for any future unboxings, future traveling, future really anything. Um, I also just found out that I'm going to Disneyland, so I'm gonna be vlogging that. I'm going to a concert. I'm doing a lot of things this summer and I really hope that you all will be there with me. So thank you. Have a good day, bye.